phone number, OTP login for Shopify store. Hello and welcome to our channel. On this video, I'm going to show you how you can use phone number for OTP to login for your Shopify store. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. And to create an account on Shopify, you could also use my affiliate link below the description where in a small commission with no additional cost to you. And by using the link, you may also get some discount or rewards upon sign up. But before that, if you don't know what is Shopify, it is a leading e-commerce platform that allows individuals and businesses to create, manage, and grow their online source with ease. In which it is designed for users of all technical skill levels, Shopify provides a user-friendly interface, customizable website templates, and a robust tools for selling products both online and in person. It also supports various sales channels including social media, marketplaces, and physical retail locations all integrated into a single dashboard. So now to create an account, just click the start for free button and start logging in using your email, Google, Apple ID, or Facebook. After that, you will be able to be directed on this homepage of Shopify. And in adding the phone number OTP for logging on your Shopify store, the first thing that we need to do is to go to the settings option on the left side panel in here by clicking this button and it will show us a variety of options and just click customer accounts. And make sure from here it will show you that you can log in links using customer accounts or log is in here. Using customer accounts, customer can log in with one time code sent to their email, but not to phone number in here. And to change that, just click the legacy right here and switch to legacy customer accounts. In order for us to set up or use the phone number to receive the OTP to log in in our Shopify store. And now by closing in here, the next thing that we need to do is to install the application. So just click add apps on the left side panel and click Shopify app store in here. Upon doing so, you will automatically be directed in this app store. So all you need to do is simply go to the search bar in here to search for OTP application. By searching on it, it will show you a variety of apps and just simply choose here this Lucent OTP login and notify, which is this one. By clicking on it, it will show us the overview about this application, including it offers an instant OTP and notification delivery for smooth logins and timely customer updates, add an email up in checkbox, and many more. But below here under the pricing, it only offers a basic and premium plan with the corresponding prices. So basically, it does not offer a free plan in here. So you need to spend this much of money in order to access this application. And now to proceed, just click the install button right here. By doing so, you'll automatically be directed on the next step in here. And all we need to do from here is to simply click again the install button on this pop-up window to proceed. But make sure to agree to the terms of use in here or service. And once done, you will automatically be opening here this application of OTP of Lucent. And to start setting up our account in here, on this OTP login and notify, we can firstly explore some of the options in here including this remaining balance on this homepage. You can track here also the number of you've sent OTP, the verified OTP and not verified OTP in here. Or you can track here on this page. You could also set the setup guide and you also do it yourself if you want to. But below under app introduction, you can simply click remind me later. And to start getting or using this in our Shopify store, all we need to do is simply go on the left side panel where it will show us the other overview about this application, including this OTP transaction. And you should be able to see here all of the list of your OTP transaction. Now under notifications, it will show you all of the notifications, including all SMS or even for WhatsApp. Now under the widget section, from here it will show you that you could also enable the app widget to your current team or add in here. I'm going to choose to enable this to our current team by clicking the button you will automatically be directed to this on the next sub where it will show us that all we need to do is simply activate and save the changes on the app embeds on the left side panel. Make sure to turn on this one and click the save button on the top right. And now once done saving, we can now proceed by going back in our page in here in our Shopify in order to navigate also the OTP login and notify the blue scent. Or we could also add a widget customization by clicking the customize button in here. To personalize the login, we have here the page view option and the model view. But currently active here is this model view, which is, this is what it looks like. 
and to customize this, you can click the customize button to be directed again on this page where you can start customizing here the OTP login or the pop-up window. Now going back on this page in here, you could also navigate on the left side panel the settings or this pricing plans for that. From here it will show you again the pricing plan that they offer with the corresponding prices and also the other benefits including on basic that offers an OTP widget seamless one-time password delivery, widget customization, boost and branding, and customer management in here with limited amount. While the premium offer a lot more than just the basic features. So you can purchase one of these depending on your needs. But going back in this page under health and support, if you also want to ask question, you can also proceed to this health and support section in here to address some of your concerns. Now moving on, if you also want to integrate some other application, you can click the settings option where you could also integrate some other provider in here by clicking this one. You could also provide using the SMS or WhatsApp with the following, but you need to have an upgrade or premium account to do so. You have here also an email if you want to, but you need again to have an upgrade or premium account. Moving on to this widget team, you could also again customize this one depending on your needs or also depending on your preferences of the design. And if you try to click or open our online store, the customer should be able to see here a pop-up window where all they need to do is simply enter their phone number and also send the confirmation code or OTP to enter here in order to log into our Shopify store. However, as I said earlier, you also need to upgrade your account in order to apply this directly in our Shopify store. Moving on, you could also choose the OTP templates in here. We have here for SMS template. This is basically what it looks like or the message with the corresponding verification code and also that says do not share it with anyone. And from here we're not be able to edit this since it is already the default one. And also this email template, you need to have also the subject line and also the template in here that says this one. Your one time password for email login is this with an OTP code in here. You'd also change the global variable below here if you want to. But moving on, this is basically the OTP templates. Now from here, you could also customize this custom data by clicking add field button right here. All you need to do is simply fill out the input, the information label, placeholder, pattern, the type, and many more. We have here also text, numbers, the length also, and any other custom fields. And again, you can start activating or customizing some of this when you already purchase the basic or the premium plan that they offer. But overall, learning how to implement phone number OTP login for Shopify store is important because it offers significantly enhances both user experience and security, in which this OTP login allows customers to sign in using their phone number, eliminating the need to remember complex passwords, which can often lead to card abandonment or login frustration. And overall, that is just basically who you can make a phone number OTP login for Shopify store. Thank you.